It all starts with a countdown. But a countdown to what exactly? Six years ago, we took on a journey to build the most advanced and the most modern communication system in the world. There are almost three billion people that don't have high-speed connectivity. Imagine if they had the ability to be connected just like you and I do, what they could do, what contributions they could make. This mission is ambitious for a truly worthy cause. It's going to impact communities that cannot be reached with fiber, traditional communications. The solution really has to be from space. You can think of Project Kuiper as a three-part system. The satellite constellation, the customer terminal, and just as critically, the ground network and software that ultimately deliver connectivity. We have set out to design the most advanced satellite network ever built. And we have created the whole thing in-house at Amazon. We need just about every technology area to contribute to build the satellite, the propulsion system, the solar arrays, the silicon, the phaser antennas, the optical inter-satellite links. The team has to be innovative, agile, resilient as we're moving very, very fast. Building, testing, developing in-house has been an extraordinary ingredient. When we first proposed Project Kuiper internally, one of the first questions was, can you produce an affordable customer terminal? We knew that was going to be the linchpin of our system. The big breakthrough for us was combining transmit and receive antennas into a single aperture. No one had ever done this in the KA band. That let us pack a ton of performance into a really compact, really low cost design. We're going to build tens of millions of these antennas and we are well on our way. The design is done. We're now in the factory manufacturing it. We uh, talk about the satellites and constellation, but Kuiper is a satellite constellation being operated as a network across hundreds of ground gateway terminals. Our ground network is spread out all over the world and each site connects back to AWS. We already have a bunch of these sites installed everywhere from Australia to Germany, and more and more of them are coming online every month. There's a big difference between launching two satellites and launching 3,000 satellites. The past couple of years, my team has really been focused on how to achieve scale. Our own dedicated payload processing facility gives us the ability to control our own destiny. We've got the capacity to integrate up to five satellites per day and launch three simultaneous campaigns. Heavy lift rockets have higher performance, so we can take more satellites to orbit on any given launch. All of our heavy lift launch partners have had a successful first flight, so that's been a pretty exciting thing for us to see because we made those investments years in advance. All of the pieces have come together to support that first launch, and the next one, and the one after that. It might not all go perfectly, but we have an incredible commitment to this project and an incredible team committed to its mission. All roads lead here, a countdown to launch. And with more than 80 missions planned, we're just getting started.